You can have anything that you want in your life. You just have to become it. Stop trying to manifest what it is you want and be the version of yourself that can manifest what you want into your life effortlessly. I'm gonna show you how to manifest what you want into your life using this Neville Goddard technique right now. Welcome back to another video, my friends. My name is BJ Iwoha and I'm your friend and your life coach. And today I'm gonna show you how to manifest what it is that you want into your life effortlessly. Listen guys, a lot of us have goals. A lot of us have dreams. Heck, all of us do. God didn't create you without putting a vision inside of you first. Here's the thing, most people don't go for their goals and most people don't go for their dreams either. Why is that? Because people become afraid of what's on the outside of them. They look at what's going on in front of them through their physical eyes and they don't see things from their spiritual eyes. God gave you a spirit. This body that you see of me, this is just a shell. The true me is on the inside of me, my spirit. That's for all of us. Listen, we're all divine beings having a human experience. The amazing thing about you is that God didn't make you like anybody else. You are fearfully and wonderfully made in his image. That means that you have God's spirit and his DNA inside of you because you come from him. You come from his essence, which means that you can speak things into existence like he can and like he does. Why? Because he's the father. And guess what? You are his child. I'm going to show you right now how to use this Neville Goddard technique to manifest anything you want into your life. Okay, guys, this is not about trying. This is not about doing some type of crazy exercise to get what it is you want. No, it's as simple as this, shifting your consciousness. What are you conscious about? Are you conscious right now of the fact that you don't have enough money in your bank account? Are you conscious of the fact that you don't have the soulmate of your dreams in your life? Are you conscious of the fact that you're working a job that you hate working at and your boss gets on your nerves? Are you conscious of the fact that whenever you try to date someone that they don't give you the time of day and they always treat you like you're second best or you're an option? What are you conscious of? You see, whatever you focus on is what you get more of. So here's what you need to do. Shift your focus. Change what it is that you want to focus on. And guess what? You will get more of that. Why is that? Because like attracts like. One of the most amazing statements that Neville Goddard made is, you don't get what you want. You get what you are. That means if you want to attract love into your life, then you have to be love radiate love be a loving person walk around with love and confidence knowing that you're already whole and complete by yourself you don't need anybody outside of you to complete you you're already whole and complete by yourself if you want to attract more money into your life then guess what walk around feeling abundant walk around feeling rich feeling wealthy you don't have to go out and try to buy some lamborghini or a ferrari to feel rich you can walk around and feel rich right now Father, thank you that I am wealthy. Thank you that I am rich. Thank you that I am abundant. Thank you that I am prosperous. You know what? Rich is not all about money. Rich is health. Rich is love. Rich can be financial as well. It's a part of it. It is a part of it. But it's not all there is. There's more to feeling wealthy than just money. But guess what? Money is also a part of being abundant. Why? Because you can do things with money that you can't do without it. You can go to vacations. You can go buy clothes that you want. You can buy food with it. You can buy shoes that you want. You can buy experiences. Money is just the means of exchange to get what it is you want. It's not about worshiping money because money is just paper. <laughs> That's all it is. Money is just a tool of exchange to get what it is that you want. And what do we want? Experiences. We want to experience vacations. We want to experience life. We want to experience abundance. We want to experience prosperity. And money is just a tool of exchange, a medium of exchange to get what it is that you want. So how do you use this Neville Goddard technique? Here's what he did. He sat in a room in a chair and he visualized himself taking a ship to go to a location that he needed to get to. Unfortunately, he was told that the ships wouldn't be able to ship out until September. I believe at this time, this is uh, earlier in the year, uh, pretty far away from September. <laughs> but what he did was he sat in a chair and he imagined himself walking up the stairs of the ship, feeling the wind on his face, putting his hands on the rail as he stepped onto the bow of the ship. 
and he could smell the sea salt. He could feel the air. He could hear the seagulls in the air. And he felt like he was on a ship. And every single time he felt that he would get distracted, he would take himself back down to the beginning and walk up the stairs, imagining this in his mind, mind you, imagining himself walking up the stairs, feeling the wind on his face, hearing the seagulls, hearing the waves of the water and looking out into the ocean. And he fell asleep. Here's a crazy thing that happened. The very next day, he got a phone call saying that somebody canceled their trip out of over thousands of people. And then they called him to take that seat. Sound like a crazy coincidence? He manifested this. That's because it's all in your mind. Your imagination is your most powerful tool. And God gave you this. God gave you this to commune with him about the desires of your heart. Not from a point of need or lack or of begging, but of communicating of gratitude. You're giving thanks already for something that has not been made manifest yet. Neville envisioned himself already being on that ship. He didn't beg for it. He envisioned himself being on the ship already, and he felt the feelings of excitement of already being on the ship, and he thanked God for it. This is how you manifest what you want. You thank God for a vision and a dream that has not yet been made manifest yet. This is how you attract things into your life. Money, love, health, opportunities, promotions, all sorts of things into your life, guys. This is how you do it. So you keep it simple. You don't try and try and try and do things. Some things will take effort, yes. I'm not saying you just sit here all day and say, okay, I'm just waiting for something to happen. <laughs> but what I am saying is that you give thanks for the vision and the goal that has not yet been made manifest yet. And then guess what? You go out into your day, you live your life and know that it's already done. It's already finished. What God has for you is already on the way. And when you live your life knowing, I already have the money. I already have the love of my life. I already have that business. Even though you don't see it here in the physical plane, but you see it here in your imagination, guess what? This is more powerful than all of this because this comes into this. Everything we see here had to be first imagined. So understand that when you imagine what's going on in your mind first, it will come out into the physical plane because you believe it, it's already done. And what's here has to align and match what's going on here. Think about it. When you think about being sick and broken all, all the time, what do you get? More sick and broke. When you think about being abundant and wealthy, what do you get? You get more abundance and wealth. So focus on what it is you want. Believe it's already done because you don't get what you want. You get what you are. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope you learned something from this. If you did already, if you haven't already, drop me a thumbs up so that this video can circulate out into the YouTube universe so that more people can see my videos. I really want more people to be able to see these and learn from these. I wanna help as many people as I can. Subscribe to the channel. Always be sure to hit that bell icon. That way you can be notified whenever I do upload new content. Even when you subscribe, YouTube won't notify you unless you hit the bell icon. And for those of you that wanna attract a loving relationship into your life, I put a course together for you. It shows you how to become a love magnet. You won't have to work hard for love. People will be chasing you and working hard to be with you. Get this course for yourself and see how it works for you. I'm sure you will love it. There's a lot of time and energy you put into it. And guess what? It works. It's almost like magic. If you're not feeling it, you get a 30 day money back guarantee. I'm not here to take your money. I'm here to get you results. With that being said, guys, I'll put some other videos up here for you. As usual, I love you guys. God bless you. And I'll see you in the next post. Peace.